Honorable Sabina Chege. Thank you, Madam Speaker. And I want to thank Honorable Junius for bringing that motion. And I concur with many things that I don't want to repeat what my colleagues have said. But, I'm, but Madam Speaker, I want to say something here that maybe no one has said. That this house also deserves to respect itself. Madam Speaker, we have had our own colleagues going out there, accusing us on all sorts of manner of things. And Madam Speaker, I have not seen anything happening to those members. I want to call upon the Speaker of this house, and I would have loved to speak when he was here, that it is time to crack the whip. Madam Speaker, we have had members of this house going to the same churches, and I respect the church so much, and we are all members of different churches, so we do not disrespect the religious leaders. But they have gone on the same altar. They have lied. They have said members of this house have been given money. They have written, and my, my friend Koibori was here, and he ran away when I told him I actually want to name him here. And Madam Speaker, we have boards and privileged committee. We have not seen them cracking the whip. Madam Speaker, last Sunday, which is very unfortunate, there were people who also had gone to our village. And on the same platform, in a church forum, I had, they are not members of this house, they are our colleagues in the Senate, claiming that they were given a certain amount of money, 20 million Kenya shillings, to impeach the Deputy President. Madam Speaker, why are we allowing the public to disrespect us? We are the same people who are going out there, telling lies about this house, then we complain when we are disrespected. I would urge, Madam Speaker, the members of this house, because there is a trend that they go, somebody just wants to become popular, or they just want to be clapped for, so they will use this house to go and talk about things that have not happened here, and nothing happens to them. Madam Speaker, I want to say once again, it is time for the Speaker of this house to crack the whip. Let people who are lying and giving false accusation about this house be brought to book. If one of them is take, a step is taken, Madam Speaker, I'm very sure the perception will change. Let us not go and dress ourselves out there. Then we come here and cry about what the other people think about us. There's something called perception. Madam Speaker, we must clear how 